Hello everyone, good day. It's a good day to learn mathematics. And so, this is Teacher Romel. Welcome to another episode of my mathematics video. So today, we are going to talk about describing and giving the value of numbers expressed in exponential form. Okay, so what is an exponent? A exponent is a number that gives the power to which the base is raised. Okay, so para mas madali natin maintindihan, so let's have an example. Okay, so let's have an example. So exponent, again, is a number that gives the power to which the base is raised para mas madali natin maintindihan. So, let's have an example. So, 4 raised to the second power, or we also call this as 4 squared, wherein 4 is a, or is our base, and 2 is our exponent. Okay. Now, base, that is the number that is used as a factor, and our exponent is the number that tells how many times the base is multiplied by itself. So, kung nakalagay dyan ay 2, so, ibig sabihin, yung multiply mo na ng dalawang beses yung base sa sarili niya. So, ganito yon. So, 4 squared is equals to 4 times 4. Since, dalawa or 2 yung ating exponent, so, dalawa rin yung ating factor. Okay, so 4 times 4 is equals to 16. Therefore, 4 squared is equals to 16. Okay? Okay, so let's have another example. So let's say for example, our base is 2 and our exponent is 5. So again, 2 is our base which means that 2 will be used as a factor and 5 is our exponent where it tells how many times the factor or the base, I mean, is used as a factor. So, kung 5 ang nakalagay dyan, so, ibig sabihin, 5 ang 2 ang gagawin natin. So, 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 1, 2, 3, 4, isa pa, times 2. Okay, and that is equals to 2 times 2 is 4 times 2 is 8 times 2 is 16 times 2 is 32. Okay, so therefore, 2 raised to the 5th power is equals to 32. Okay, so let's have another example. So, negative 5 raised to the third power. So, naka-enclose sa parenthesis yung negative 5. Okay? So, same. Our negative 5 is our base. 3 is our exponent. So, meaning, we're going to multiply 5 3 times. Okay? So, 5 times 5 times 5. So, tatlong 5 kasi yung exponent natin ay 3. So, 5 times 5 is 25 times 5 is equals to 125. Now, meron tayong negative sign dito. So, paano yun? Dapat meron ding sign to. Pero ano kaya? Negative or positive? So, meron tayong rule. Once ang ating exponent ay odd number, so, 3 is an odd number. Alright? So, kapag odd number ang ating exponent, ang ating sign ng sagot is negative. Okay? So, negative pagka-add number. Now, once ang ating exponent ay an even number, so our answer is positive number. So, let's say for example, so negative 2 raised to the fourth power. So, that is uh, i-multiply natin na apat na beses yung 2 so 2 times 2 times 2 
and times 2. Okay? So, 2 times 2 is 4, times 2 is 8, times 2 is 16. Pero ano yung sign niya since negative siya? So, since ang ating exponent is an even number, that is an even number, so our answer is a positive number. Okay? So, once again, ulitin ko, kapag ang exponent at ay add number, our answer is negative. Kapag even number, our answer is positive. So, positive, yun yung sign ng positive. Pero hindi na natin ilalagay yan, no? So, in short, so negative 5 raised to the third power is equals to negative 125. But negative 2 raised to the fourth power is equals to positive 16. Okay? Okay, so another example. So let's say we have 5 as our base and our exponent is 0. So paano yan? So rule natin is any base raised to 0 power. So 0 exponent natin that's equals to 1. Okay, ano ba? 6 raised to 0. That is equivalent to 1. So basta 0 exponent that is equals to 1. Okay? Any number raised to 0 exponent that is equivalent to 1. Now about if our exponent is let's say 3 raised to the first power, 1. The answer is 3. Okay? So kahit ano pa yan, number, so remain yung base natin, 4 pa rin. Okay? So let's say 10 raised to the first power, the answer is 10. Okay? So, very good. Okay, so let's practice. Practice tayo. So, number 1. Try to answer this. 3 raised to the first power. The answer is... Okay, very good. 3. Nice one. Number 2. Let's say 7 raised to 0 power. The answer is... Okay, very good. 1. Number 3. A 4 raised to the third power. That is equals to 4 times 4 times 4. Kasi tatlo yun, no? And the answer is... 4 times 4 is... 16. Diba? 16 times 4 is ilan? Hurry up. Solve. 16 times 4 is Okay. Very good. The answer is 64. Okay. For number 4. Negative 2 raised to the say Oops. Uh, gawin natin 5 Okay So Remember 5 is an Add number So that is 2 So lima, no? 2 times 2 Times 2 Times 2 Ilan na? 1, 2, 3, 4 Isa pa Times 2 Is equals to 2 times 2 4 times 2 8 Times 2 16 Times 2 is 32 Now what will be our Sign Negative or positive this is an odd number. Oh, okay, very good. Negative. So, negative 32. And last one, number 5. So, let's see, negative 3 raised to the second power. So, that is 3 times 3 is equals to. What's the answer? Negative or positive? Oh, okay, that is positive 9. Okay, bakit positive? Kasi yung exponent natin is an even number. Okay? So, I hope mayroon tayong naintindihan. Good luck guys and have a safe day.